In real time, I'm jumping back. Uh, this this says second year, 178th day. It really, this is the third year in real time. It would be the 56th day, I think, or something. But I left. I had left three days off the the second year, and now I'm going back. Uh, uh, and and so what what I why I'm doing that is because I wasn't really quite ready to show you how far the beast got, uh, and and now was a good time. So this is. This is a final update for the second year on the development of the beast. Well, the beast is this massive uh, incinerator or outdoor furnace uh, that I'm building uh, that will be able to heat an entire pallet, a wooden pallet, or burn, or six or eight of them, uh, without, uh, without cutting them up. <clears throat> what I'm going to do with all that heat, I'm just not sure. Um, there are the other projects from, I won't turn the camera, but uh, when I went into the year, uh, there was the neighbor's barn. I, I, I listed that as a project I would be dealing with. I haven't done much with that. It's there, uh, and I'll clean it up, and I still fully intend to put it back up. I'm quite convinced I can do it. But as the year went out, I, I just had other things I had to see to. Contour gardening, uh, I hadn't in anticipated that at the beginning of the year, but in any case it worked out fine uh, with tires. <laughs> with tires. Uh, it was uh, of great interest uh, to the community and I certainly will do that. That's the way I will garden, uh, certainly here. Uh, 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 so uh, really a big success. Recycling concrete blocks. <clears throat> I, I showed uh, I showed some of that as a project, and it's not finished. Uh, it, there isn't really that much more to show uh, there, but, but I'll be going back to that. And there are no doubt other projects as well. And I say projects, projects. That's the way we say it. Well, you can say projects. <laughs> you can say that, I guess. But uh, So henceforth, it's going to be projects. And much of the third year, that's the year that I'm teaching now, will be projects. Uh, I'll, you know, I'm going to be outdoors uh, a lot filming the things I do, if they're interesting. I'm not just going to film any old project that I'm working on. If it's, if it's an unusual one, uh, worthy of interest, well then, I, then I'll film it. And I think there will be quite a few of those. Uh, well, when you look at this, <clears throat> the first two sequences are out of order. They're reversed. Uh, the second view that you see uh, with the bridge that I slid the beast up, that, that should come first because uh, right at the beginning I've taken the temporary bridge down. And further back in the year, I didn't look to see what the numbers were, but further back in the year there, there are other videos, uh, I believe, of, uh, of the development of this, uh, I think. Well, in any case, you can imagine it. Um, <clears throat> I mentioned the Aku Aku method, well, just a couple just a little bit at a time, a little bit at a time. Uh, that's the way I had to do that because as much of it I did all by myself. Uh, and uh, it will be continued. Uh, the beast is not finished by any means, but I thought that would be a good place to stop when you could envision uh, a, a, a floor uh, o over the, uh, the mat. Oh, I know, and another thing I mentioned, the in one of them I mentioned the dome. I, I don't mean dome, I meant vault. Uh, the, the beast itself, the firebox is covered with a, a vault, not a dome. A dome, well, it's not important, but I, I caught it. So, uh, <clears throat> anyway, uh, I have two, day, two days left in the second year, and um, uh, in, enjoy seeing what I'm doing with the beast. I, I'm quite convinced there's nothing else quite like it. Bye now.